Hey, so this is the reality test of International English Language Testing System powered by IDP to access the level of the candidate. My name is Nana Sharma and I am here to conduct the speaking of the candidate number 1539 whose name is Himanshu Bhanibha. Okay. So shall we start? Yes. What is your full name? My first name is Himanshu and my last name is Bhanibha. Okay. How may I address you? You may address me by my first name Himanshu. Okay. So Himanshu, where are you from? I am from India and my hometown is Bikanir and that's in Rajasthan state. Do you like your hometown? Yes, I like my hometown. Do you want to change your hometown in the future? Um, I guess I would have to since I am going to college now so I have to change my hometown but generally I really like my hometown. So let's talk about your hometown and village only. Okay? What kind of place, a place is it? Um, it's a really nice place because it's really known for its sports and cultural heritage and Bikan is really famous for its sweets and namkeen and it's a really great destination for it. What, uh, what's the most interesting part of your town? Interesting part I would say that it, it has a Kandi Mata temple and it has um, a really great number of rats, I would say. People worship rats there. What kind of jobs do people in your hometown do? And they can do various kinds of jobs that they like, but I would say most of them are government employees and or are doctors or in medical profession. Would you say it's a good place to live? Yeah, I would say it's a good place to live since it is it has like all the facilities a person can ask for and it is really safe for a family to live. What is the particular reason you like your hometown the most? Uh, I would say that I really like that because I have spent like my last 12 or 13 years there and I have my whole family and my friends there. Okay, let's talk about tiredness. Okay, What kind of things make you tired? And there can be various things that can make a person tired. I would say that uh, working like if you take a, you can say uh, coaching like of three to uh, seven to eight hours that can make you tired, working out can make you tired or sometimes you sleep for like twelve or thirteen hours that can also make you tired. What do you do when you feel tired? I would uh, I just like eat or drink something to get my energy and electrolytes up or I would just go for a walk. Whom do you usually talk to when you feel mentally tired? Uh, I would say that I uh, I would talk to my friend or my elder brother. Okay, so this is the end of our part one. Now we're going to start our part two. So here it is your cue card card with some questions. Okay, this is restaurant. Talk about a magazine or article you read about healthy living or an online article about healthy life. Okay, these are some questions you have to answer that. Now you have one minute to plan your ideas. After that you have to speak for two minutes on this topic. Who do I get to keep this card or you will take it there? Have it with you.
that time, I would say people really focus on their fitness and they where they live, where they live their lives. And the article I want to talk about is like of weight loss. Like since in lockdown we were at home for like year and a half, and I guess everybody on some extent gained a lot of weight. Like I used to be like 45 or 46 kilograms before the lockdown, and I gained like 25 kilos in one and a half year so I was nearing 75 kilograms so I gained a lot of fat so it was necessary for me to lose weight so I started surf, surfing the internet booking stuff about that so I came across a website that had, had a, like, a diet plan for you and a exercise plan for you like they used to give different type of exercises for you, uh, for you to do every day and uh, the diet you can have and the fascinating thing that I learned from that website was a thing called intermediate fasting in that you eat for 8 hours in a time period of 8 hours and you fast for like the next 16 hours and that really helped me to lose weight and moreover I would say the main point that was highlighted there was to cut out any forms of sugar like uh, the sugar we generally have in everything like in sweets, in milk, in tea uh, the tea part was easy for me since I don't like tea and I don't really drink tea but I am really fond of drinking, uh, drinking curd with uh, sugar but that was something I would say difficult for me but the rest part was easy and in the end I like lost 15 kg of weight and it was really helpful for me. Okay. Now I will ask you more follow up questions regarding this topic. What are the most popular ways of keeping healthy in your country? The popular, the popular I would say the most would be cutting out sugar, like it's the easiest and the second would be to exercise or just to walk every day. Uh, I think people generally walk after dinner, that's a good way to digest sugar. Do you think most people worry about their health as they get older? I believe there comes a time in everybody's life then they think about themselves and their health most uh, th that time and I think yeah, sometimes, yes I think sometimes that can come in like in the early age of like 20 or 19 and can somebody like for 40 years old or so. Do you think uh, some people continue bad habits when they know that they are damaging to their health? I believe I will say that so because sometimes when you are like uh, if it is going bad what how more can it go bad like if somebody is uh, smoking for like I would say five years and they think oh what will happen if I do it for one year or more two years more it gets really difficult for them to do How can children be encouraged to adopt healthy eating habits? The first thing I think that should be done is to have a great school and diet options like uh, school should give them a proper diet chart or something options to choose from for their having lunch and parents should be educated what should they provide their child or offspring for eating and they should encourage them to uh, don't go to fast food uh, joints that much because fast food can really help them in their old ages. Okay, it's time for the speaking session. Thank you so much.